Some San Diegans are lashing out during this pandemic, punching police officers and throwing objects at store clerks. We are now entering a new stage of the coronavirus recovery, and some are reacting with anger. Our tennis reporter Cassie Carlisle spoke with the police about the rising agitation and got expert advice on managing the pressure. The tension is high. He got very frustrated with me and he threw a bucket at me and he stormed out of the store. A San Diegan who works in retail spoke with us anonymously saying she's afraid to lose her job. She said that's what happened on Wednesday when she asked a customer to wear a mask. I felt very uncomfortable and threatened because I was just doing my job and I did not feel like I deserved that from that gentleman. Just the latest act of aggression we've heard in the past couple weeks. Last Saturday, thousands protested the stay at home order. This is treason, this is tyranny. That night, a police officer was punched in the head while trying to shut down a party in San Ysidro. The crowd swarmed and officers were called in from all over the city to help. What they're telling me is that there's a little bit more anger. Uh, there's a little bit more pushback they're seeing from the community. Sunday, bicyclists attacked a woman who got out of her car to scold them for ignoring traffic signals. Unfortunately for people who are not in treatment or who are not like very savvy with their own emotion, what ends up happening is it's just instant fire. Psychologist Dr. Michelle Carcel said we all need to take a second and find out what's behind that anger. Anger is an umbrella emotion. A lot of times what's underneath anger is pain. So when we feel wronged, when we feel hurt, we get angry, we get defensive. Dr. Carcel said it's important to channel that anger toward a solution, like writing to an official. If you're on the receiving end of that anger, she said stay calm and be empathetic to defuse the situation. Everyone is facing challenges right now. This whole time is very difficult. We just want to help them out, get you what you need, and you guys go on with your way without any difficulties. Easing the tension in this tough time. Cass Carlisle, 10 News. If you need to talk with someone about that frustration, you're asked to call the California Peer Run Warm Line at 855-845-7415.